Ole, 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 and welcome to All Your Living Needs. I'm your host, Jono, and this is the Major League Soccer 2014 predictions for the San Jose Earthquakes versus the Chicago Fire. Now, this game is taking place at 10.30 p.m. on Wednesday, July 23rd. Previous meetings, uh, we see that Chicago has won two and tied two uh, against the San Jose Earthquakes, and they've only lost one. Now, uh, when we look at season goal leaders, we've got Chris Wondolowski, who has uh, gained six goals so far this year. Last year, uh, 2012 was the year that he was the uh, most goal... Um, what do we call that? Hold on a second. He is uh, top goal scorer of 2012. So uh, we also have Victor Bernandez, Adaba Harris. Both of those guys have two. Kari Stevenson has two. Yannick Dijalo has one. Cordello Cato has one. Jean-Baptiste uh, Perazzi has one. And Steven, uh, Steven Lenhart has, I believe, we need to update this, and he has two because he just scored a goal this week. Uh, Chicago Fire has Harrison Ship, who has scored six goals this year. Quincy Amarwaka, Amarkawa, apologize there. Uh, Mike McGee, of course, he's great. And Jeff Larentowski. So when we look at the season stats, the uh, San Jose Earthquakes have played 17 games. Chicago Fire have played 18 games. Uh, San Jose has won four. Um, Chicago has won three. San Jose has lost eight. And uh, Chicago Fire has lost four. San Jose has uh, drawn five. And Chicago Fire has drawn 11. So now when I look at, when I review the last game that they played against the Red Bulls, San Jose Earthquakes, Hernandez made an amazing deflection uh, but the star of the night was really Lenhart, uh, with a great attempted assist on a goal to tie up the game, and uh, and then he also tied up the game with a goal. I apologize there for the writing. Wondolowski is, of course, a very strong player, having been named the top goal scorer of 2012. Chicago Fire in the game against Philadelphia Union. In the 59th minute, Jeff Larentowski got a header assisted by Harrison Ship uh, with a cross following the corner. And in the 89th minute, there was a bad penalty called by the ref for a handball uh, off Gonzalo Segaris. That should have never been called. His arm was tucked in. It just happened to have been where the ball went. And that, unfortunately, led to a goal score against the Chicago Fire tying up the game. Chicago Fire really should have won that game. They were playing it really solid. Now, what is my prediction? I actually think these guys are really matched very well. But uh, I think that when you're looking at teamwork, um, you've got to aim towards San Jose. They understand where their players are, where they need to be, um, and that's why there's so many more of them that are scoring goals. Uh, of course, everything you know depends on you know the right team and all that, but uh, I believe that San Jose is going to win this one, and they're actually going to win it really big. I think it's going to be a three to one score. So. That's my prediction there. Please subscribe, share, comment, and like. Um, you know, and of course, we're running the big contest, right? So this is the cleats to win. Make sure you watch that video. It's on the page, and that's all the instructions on that video that you know you have to do, and then uh, we'll pick a winner in October. So, thanks so much for watching. Ole, ole, ole. Have a great day. Uh, cheers. Thanks so much.